Hello everybody. <laughs> Welcome back to my channel, Pretty Hands by John Readings. This reading will be for my Earth signs, Capricorn towards Virgo for the upcoming week of December 16th, 2019. So on the 22nd, we start, well, it's winter solstice, right? So we officially start winter, even though don't tell that to my body right now. <laughs> we like it's real winter. Um, so yes, that's when everything is kind of at rest, right? Even the plants, the flowers, they're resting now. But at the same time, we start Capricorn season and you know Capricorn is all about slow and steady winning the race being a mountain goat right steady steadily taking um, steps towards your greatness right and eventually getting there Capricorns get there they might have to eat a couple cans but those goats eventually make it up the mountain so just keep that in mind earth signs <laughs> what are the major things for earth signs for the Oklahoma week of December 16 2019 please Okay, so angel number 538 earth signs. Look it up and see if it resonates. So fun fact, I had to redo this reading and guess what? This tiger came up and in the same spot. So I love when that happens because the universe be emphatic with stuff. So with this lotus rebirth, y'all got some changes coming. Y'all got some big changes coming. I told you that last week. It was like the last struggle before success. This is, this is letting you know, this is, we're wrapping this up. See, here's the thing. With the beginning of winter solstice, it's not just, okay, winter is coming and we got to bring out the cute boots and all that other stuff. What you do, <laughs> you should. But you also have to remember what winter symbolizes in most cultures. In the United States, it's ass, you know, it's bass backwards here, right? We start the new year in the dead of winter. That ain't how it go in most places. Most places, they start in the spring because it's renewal. That's when everything is we have been going through all these crazy transits to get us ready for our greatness in 2020 it's okay your stability is coming you don't have nothing else to worry about the healing is coming you don't believe me y'all don't believe me and i understand that because i wouldn't believe me either if it didn't change but i know because i studied it i look into this stuff i i read a lot so i understand what's going on because even with my own life i'm like what the heck is happening am i being punished but it's like, no, honey, these is just the trends that you got to go through. And look, this is a nine, the end of cycles. Nine is about completion. We just finished the full, the Gemini full moon, right? We're still in that energy right now. But don't worry about it. The heat. Right? Creativity, joy, doubled. Create, uh, creation, self-expression, happiness center look at this this is beautiful the the arrow landed exactly where it's supposed to be and this also symbolizes love again so look there's a lot of men all men and a baby some of y'all could be manifesting that everything is on target baby everything look you getting divine help everything is on target partnerships divine partnerships y'all are good earth signs i promise y'all are I promise y'all, Lord. I'm not just telling you that to be nice. I mean, <laughs> I want to be nice, but the cards are saying it. It's right here. Seven circles inset. You have help from above the divine. The divine has a higher view of your life than you do. 
So keep toiling. It's not a coincidence that this card came right under the four bamboo cards, right? He's worked hard for years and years, his whole life, and he's exhausted. Now he's just sitting like, I ain't got nothing else. I can't lift no more rocks, right? I can't do nothing else. I just, this is all I got. I'm just here. I'm alive. And that's okay. He made it through. But the universe is saying, I got you now. You did all the work. Don't even worry about it. Look, success. <laughs> South. It's emphatic. These cards are emphatic. You are exhausted, but you're on the right track, and success is coming. It's here. Eight bamboo mushroom. Unconventional relationships. Expecting the unexpected things happening in a different way than you expected. And that's okay. Look at that. Right underneath the center. So an unexpected love or um, a partner, a person that you didn't probably didn't even pay attention to, that you never, you're like, oh, that person? Oh. Ugh, girl, no, nah, ain't nothing. A boy, no, nah, dude, no, nah, ain't no. Nah. She cool. She all right, but we ain't like that. And then, then, look, bam. Universe is like, actually, that person is for you, right? Or that opportunity is for you. They have a surprise for you. The universe has a surprise for you, Earth Science. They say unexpected, unexpected. Wow. Bam. I love that. Y'all deserve this reading. Y'all deserve every card in this reading. Y'all deserve it. I love that it ended like that. I love it. I love giving good news, and I especially love to give good news to Earth Signs right now because y'all been, I mean, like I said, everybody been going through it, but y'all readings have just been just relentless. Like, we've been going through it too, but y'all have been man. But look, look, baby, look, baby, look at this. Bam, a second center card. What I tell you, when they start repeating, that means the message has already been transmitted. Success center, this is love. Ain't no women in this spread. <laughs> so if you are a female watching this and you are trying to manifest this, it's coming. Ain't no women in this spread. And all of the men, look, you have the tiger. He gets his. He gets it done. The commence, right? The archer. He's shooting his shot. These are men of, of means. These are men of movement, of motion. He come with a tiger. He's not playing. He don't come playing no games with y'all. These are, they're working on their greatness. And you look at them and you see greatness. You already know, oh, he's an archer. I know how you spend your time. I know how you spend your time, right? And then you have the old man who has done the work. He's done it. This is beautiful. Success, love, success in partnerships after having worked hard. A rebirth. Some of y'all are literally manifesting like happily ever after with a baby and all that. And it's, it's in the cards. Three circles, Phoenix. What did I tell you about these threes? Joy and happiness and self-expression and creativity and divinely feminine energy phoenix is rising from the ashes the universe has to send you to put y'all through this earth sign so that you can rise so that you can tell your story you can get your glory that's how it go look at all of the greats they all have these ridiculously like hard starts and you know ups and downs and this is heart-wrenching but guess what that's how they reach their greatness bam blank card nothing Nothing. I was trying to anticipate what the last card would be after getting these two beauties. Universe, like, that's it. Leave it on that. Look at that. Three circles, Phoenix. Three. And that's money, too. It ended on three, three, three. In addition to these threes. This is beautiful. No women in this spread. Very, very interesting. Look up angel number three, 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 two, earth signs. I love that for y'all. Y'all so deserve it. So deserve it. So deserve it. Okay, I'm going to do the fortune telling book again this week. Just because I feel like it. Okay, so it's harder to shuffle these. <laughs> I'm only gonna do one card. I know I pose a read. No, 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 no. That ain't how I do it. Okay. Virgo. All right, Virgo. Your message is so you got the jack of clubs and I will see okay so Virgo your keywords studious young man ha y'all got all little men in it spread I love this some of y'all are literally manifesting a new like amazing person in your life this affectionate flirtatious young man is a bit of a lovable rogue what did y'all not see the, the tiger <laughs> I knew it Hard working and determined, his great ambitions often bring just rewards. He may influence you to move home or change direction. Bam. Reverse. Beware. Like all knaves, he can be destructive to you and himself through youthful folly. Oh. That's so deep, Virgo. Because y'all had all the men in the general reading. None. All men, not a single woman. 
So this is a good guy, but remember they said, um, right, rogue, right, we saw the tiger, hardworking, I told you that. But at the same time, right, he and all that. You got to have your own life, Virgo, your own mind. Don't be like, ah, oh, he just, I just was following him, girl. Uh-uh. Well, I just was following her, you know, because dudes be watching these too. All right, Taurus, I got y'all. So y'all got nine of clubs too. All these club suits. Club is about business, about money, which makes sense because in the general reading, it said that y'all was making some progress on it. Immediate opportunities. You are very much in control of your fast track career. A solution to financial difficulties will arrive in nine weeks or in September. Longtime friends will back you and rejoice when you succeed. The shadow side, reverse. Your situation is unstable. Keep a low profile. So whatever resonates with you, Taurus. But remember what I just told you. I told y'all the opportunities are coming in the general reading. I told you that. This is beautiful. I love when it happens. on the up and up for you but remember we're coming out of things and we are starting capricorn season we are starting your season right so just keep that in mind you you know how it goes i feel like i don't have to explain nothing more to y'all because y'all know how it go all right y'all thank you for listening have a great week peace out